Former Razorback Peyton Hillis continues to recover today from a swimming accident while on vacation in Florida. And as the news started to circulate on Thursday, the support for Hillis and his family started to spread. We haven't gotten an update today from his family on his status, but we did talk to friends who are rooting for him. He's the only Razorback athlete to be on a Madden cover. I mean, a, a lot of people know about that. And just to hear something bad happen to such a good person, uh, it, it makes your heart go out to him. Former Razorback running back Peyton Hillis has a lot of people rooting for his recovery. From his college coach, Houston Nutt, former Razorbacks like Chris Gregg and people all across the country. He's a fighter and a winner. And uh, when I heard it, I just... Um, couldn't believe it and hoping, uh, boy, everything's going to be okay and uh, um, just hoping for the best. And uh, I'm, I'm hearing things are, are better, so I hope, I hope that continues to be. Vacationing with family in Pensacola, Florida, we've learned Hillis was involved in a swimming accident, helicopter to a hospital, and remains in the ICU. What a great thing of uh, being a great father, but also protecting those children. Uh, from that dangerous ocean that, you know, if you get too far out, you get riptide or whatever the currents. News of Hillis in the hospital spread quickly amongst those close to him. A, a lot of former players were all in a group message. And the first thing people called him was Superman. They was like, that's a real live Clark Kent. This doesn't come as a surprise. That's, that's who he is, to run out there and save his, his kids is exactly what any dad would do. But it's, uh, it's right in line with him. His character. Family friend Jason Everett became Hillis's youth pastor in 1998. He got the phone call about the accident on Thursday. Tragic because uh, Peyton is such a good young man and has always represented our state well, the city of Conway well, and uh, has uh, just a wonderful family. Everett says him and his family lived in northwest Arkansas when Hillis was playing for the Razorbacks, and he knows the outpouring of support means a lot to the Hillis family. You know, we're a small state, and uh, it, uh, uh, I'm actually glad of that because it's, it's times like this where you see the, the true family uh, come together to support each other. And like many others, they too have a message of support to share. I want to let them know that I'm praying for them. I'm praying for the family. I'm especially praying for Peyton. I hope everything goes well. I hope he comes back stronger. And uh, this could just be another thing that he can give a testimony about. Peyton, I just want you to know that my family has uh, kept you in our prayers. And, and uh, I have no doubt that uh, you're going to come through this because you've always been an overcomer. You've always been somebody that surprised everybody.